Hey everybody, hope your day is going well. We are back with Barbara Streisand. It had to be you. And this was a request by David. Thank you so much for this request and donation. And this uh, particular performance is from a 1966 TV special, Color Me Barbara. And this was when Color TV was making its way to the homes uh, in Middle America, as far as I'm told. I'm, I'm wondering in Belgium when it came to, you know... You know, always the, the trends come a little bit later here. And I think I asked my mom once. She was born in 65 and she still remembers when they had their first TV. So it must have been later than 65. She still remembers that. So maybe 69, 70 or something. Uh, very interesting. You know, we grew up with TV. We couldn't think of a time before. Color TV or TV. And then now my daughter doesn't remember a time without internet tablets and phones which is a whole nother thing <laughs> okay let's jump into this one this is going to be interesting it's so cool that we can get uh these videos on the internet man from so long ago This is just it's mesmerizing to watch her and and i've done one of these older performances from 65 i believe it was still black and and white um then i think that performance uh but man that's and it's amazing that they've been able to make it you know like maybe upscale it a little bit to to this type of quality uh, cause I've been watching some home videos from, from my own, uh, I was, you know, taking some VHSs and putting them on digital and these are from 93, 94, it's such sucky quality. But of course that was a home video camera, not a studio quality camera, but still, uh, it, it's 60 years old. Uh, wow. And just her voice, man, it's that old timey quality, almost like these type of songs or performances are just not around anymore some people maybe recreate it but it's just it has that je ne sais quoi do you know what i mean um and also when i was looking up the lyrics because i do have the lyrics up here on screen i saw this was a, a song from 1924 so it's actually you know as of recording it's 100 years old gus khan isham jones 
uh, I believe you have uh, written and composed it. So hundred, so that's that's amazing. So we're still listening to this a hundred years later. That is pretty cool. You don't know when this person was writing and these people were composing it. You don't always expect like people going to be listening to this in a hundred years, but because of people like Barbara, they keep it alive. And I thought this is also used in the movie um, when Harry met Sally, but I, I've seen that film like two times, but I, I don't really remember that song from it. I, I remember the restaurant scene. <laughs> wow. So this is a song that stands the test of time and with performances like these, Oh man, that's amazing, yo. It is really like a portal in time and you know what a progression. What a career, what a legend. The way she goes from that gentle singing a little bit in the high registers to that powerful, you know, belting like but it seems so seamless, so effortless. She's in the performance is like there's no cameras on her, you know, she's just there by herself almost, you know, and everything else disappears. Oh, wow. Just amazing and a beautiful song too. The lyrics, you know, uh, even glad to, to to be sad thinking of you. Like that type of love that we understand, you know, with all your faults, I love you still, you know. That is what it's about. Uh, beautiful. And 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 before I said like the way she goes from, from gentler singing to, to belting. Belting was maybe a little too much because... That is almost like when somebody's really going at it and almost can't go anymore. But you can hear here, even when she puts more force behind certain notes, but more power, it's still like she has so much left in the tank, you know? That's what I meant by is she makes it seem like easy. It's like she has so much support still. She could, you know, like restraint in performance is such a, a powerful tool. And she knows how to use that, like... Like, all right, I'm doing a bit more here, but I can still, you know, go out when I need to. Like, wow, that that balance of not always showing off and just serving the song, serving the performance, knowing when to pull back, when to go more. And that's a skill. That's a skill. Um, and self-restraint. <laughs> we all know that ain't so easy. <laughs> Beautiful performance. So uh, glad I uh, got to see this. So thank you for introducing me to it. I had no idea this one existed as so many other things I have no idea about. But, you know, it's so cool that we get to see this. Awesome. Barbara Streisand, It Had to Be You, 1966, a song that's from 1924. We're checking it out in 2024. Hey, who knows? Maybe somebody else in 100 years We'll be checking it out too. Hopefully. Maybe they'll be checking out this video. Please don't. <laughs> Hi to the future. Hi from the past. Thank you for being here, everybody. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.